here's a retro intro for you. Welcome all you plus two comedy modifiers back to the stream. Welcome back to the Not Prawn Riddle. TV's Noah here, smoothie in hand. Mm. As I try to take on one of the Not Prawn weeklies. This is a riddle created by the Not Prawn community. And I try to solve it using nothing but my brain and your help in the chat below and in the comments on YouTube. Nobody comments on YouTube anymore. That used to be a big help. Nobody cares anymore. <laughs> But hey, yes, we are still doing Ender's Puzzle. So as you can see right here, if you go to weeklies.ignomatics.org, you can participate in the weekly puzzle. This week, we got Molten Lava Weekly by Molten Lava Core, not Molten Lava Cake, which is what I prefer. And uh, you can participate in this right now. It was vetted by Weaver, who's in the chat. What's up, Weaver? And uh, if you saw that, you can join all these cool people, like Pot123 Opatop and Yo!, and Ender. But uh, I'm not going to be doing this one because I don't do spoilies, so I don't want to do the active one. So we're going to scroll down and we are going to head to, I can't think of a name, by Ender. So this is where we're at. I got to this website. I then checked out the background image. The background image was a black bar. Uh, the hexadecimal numbers told me which letter in each sentence I should pay attention to. That got me the code blocks object. I was then able to download a blocks.object file, which was a 3D series of blocks uh, that said two things. One, it said, and I have, I'm not sure, it either said snicked, which is the sound that Wolverine's claws make, S-N-K-T, or possibly uh, 6-N-K-T. Uh, this was nothing. This was wrong, if I remember. Uh, the other thing it said was ListTube, which is a website. So uh, I've been screwing around a little bit with uh, ListTube, like I, I signed in or whatever, and I found uh, this, which fe seems suspicious. Uh, basically, what I learned was, I did a little off-stream uh, research here, uh, I was looking for, I can get back to this, uh, 6NKT. I kept looking for this, and I kept getting this, and this was a weird rabbit hole that I shouldn't be going down. Don't, don't actually play it. I'll get copyright strikes. So I kind of took it that I didn't understand how this website worked, so I spent some time off tube, uh, off Twitch rather, trying to figure it out, and I found this button, and this let me look by list. And then when I searched uh, 6NKT, whoops, or maybe 6NKT, it brought me here. Do not play my Sharona right now. Uh, so I think this might be something just because this is so suspicious, these two. Um, and then I was like, ah, I should stop, like, screwing around. What's up, uh, OP Rocks? Uh, so that's as far as I got, and then I stopped, just so you guys could join me on the journey. Uh, I have not listened to the last two. So I think they might be something. It's just, I don't know. Uh, in terms of the songs, uh, I, I know some of these. And I guess I will evaluate them as a whole later, but... I'm going to click on this and just see what it is and hopefully not get a copyright strike. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Split them. Split them by Quan the Ruler. I don't know why it's called clocks. <laughs> but... I got the bromenum. Yeah, here we go. I don't know. I don't like I think that's the major problem I'm having is I'm just not familiar with how list tube works. So again, I might be down another rabbit hole that I know nothing about. But this is the thing I found. Um I never actually searched the other one either. Maybe I should do that. Uh, 
I'll let me look. Let me listen to this, and then I'll search the other one just to be sure. What's the fuss? What's the fuss? Tell me what's happening. What's the fuss? Stop. Again, so this is a... Ooh. So, this has a very interesting word in it, which is visioneer, uh, which is a type of cipher. So maybe I am... See, I'm so afraid I'm just, like, down an insane rabbit hole. Uh, to get slightly off topic, uh, my podcast, Stay Doomed, just covered Push Nevada, which was another giant rabbit hole that I fell down and created a lot of problems with myself. If you can listen to that podcast today. It'll drop later today. Um... This is this is a not prawn weekly. This is created by uh, Ender, someone from the not prawn community. Uh, so, yes, yeah, yeah. I, I tell a big story at the end of this podcast that shows what happens when you fall down a rabbit hole. Uh, in any case, there's enough here that makes me think this is the right rabbit hole. Just the weird names here in the uh, the endings. And the word visioneer, because it's a cipher. Like, we might just be, like, last week I was looking at uh, at Russian and stuff. Uh, just for my own sanity, I'm going to do the other one. It was uh, S-N-K-T. No result. Okay. All right, so this, stop playing my Sharona. <laughs> this isn't Wayne's World. You ever wake up? It's just that same song is in stuck in your head the whole time. My Sharona. You guys ever see Wayne's World? Uh, so did we get a weird... Is there any information in this? Split them. Mm, so maybe... Now I want to say it's something about splitting them up. <laughs> I sang it perfectly, too. I sang it exactly like The Knack. Or, or exactly like Wayne Campbell, in, if you're a big fan of the movie. Uh, so, we got Tlocks, and so, is there anything they all have in common? You know, I have kind of just skipped over these, because I was, uh, I didn't want any copyright strikes, but... Uh, let's see, we got My Sharona by The Knack. I know that one. Uh, Spin the Bottle by June, uh, Julia Hatfield. Three. There's three Julia and Hatfields just running around. Uh, and the third, at least three. And the third one created Spin the Bottle. Uh, Indian's Bed of Roses. Not familiar with that. Uh, World Party. When You Come Back to Me? No. The Posies. Going, going, gone. The Posies. That makes me think Wizard of Oz, but I don't know. Lisa Loeb, stay. You say. It makes me want to say. Stay. You're allowed to do covers, I think. Uh, usual respect for, for streaming puzzles to these freaks. Thanks, Thick. You're my favorite person to stop by because I like saying your name like that. Uh, these are people that know about tangents. Tangents? Like, what the fuck is that even? Batteries. No, batteries! Magnets! How do those shit work? Uh, let's see what else. Oh, sorry. I, I got distracted by the chat. Uh, so I know Stay. All I Want Is You by U2. I know U2. I, I'm not familiar with that song. All I want is you. Uh -huh. That's U2, right? All I want is you. Uh, Crowded House Locked Out, no idea. Lenny Kravitz, I hate Lenny Kravitz, personally. Uh, uh, Spinning Around Over You, don't know it. I only really know American Woman, and I don't I don't care for that song. Uh, Ethan Hawke's, Ethan Hawke? <laughs> the, the, the dude from Boyhood? <laughs> Do you have a music career? Uh, isn't there 
I, I'm trying to think of a, a time Ethan Hawke sings. I think there's a movie where he sings um, Violent Femmes. Why can't I get just one kiss? Why can't I get let me go? Blister in the sun. That's it. I think he's to, Ethan Hawke sings that in a movie. Anyone? Anyone in the back know what the hell I'm talking about? Reality Bites. Yes. Reality Bites. Uh, <laughs> the Noah to Prawn Weeklies. The fact that I never thought of that as, uh, <laughs> as the name is stupid. Um, uh, Dinosaur Jr. Uh, I know Dinosaur Jr. from Rock Band. I don't know the song. Me Fill Me, Revival, Squeeze by Tevin. Big, um, oh, I, I, get, I thought it was Mountain Goats because I love Mountain Goats, but it's Big Mountain. Baby, I love your way every day. One of their night and day. Uh, yeah, that's interesting. The the Ethan Hawke is in there. Uh, it's not my Sharona in. Uh, you know how how. You know how is your name in Portuguese? I do not. I do, I do not know how my name is in Portuguese. I know Noah means rest. Uh, by the way, I'm an idiot. Uh, it's Mickey in Wayne's World that he wakes up. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. It's Noel. Ah. Uh, um... Is my Sharona also in Reality Bites? Isn't that the... Is this, what's the, the song that's playing with Janine Garofalo's, like, hey, can you turn that up? And her and Winona Ryder uh, dance in the grocery store. <laughs> is that... I think they danced it in the convenience store. Is it my yeah, and and the dude from Saving Silverman's in it. Hmm. All right. Like well, I shouldn't go to like. Yeah. I'm just curious what this is. <laughs> Is this, like, the scene from Reality Bites? Like, what is this? I don't want this. Oh, wait, where's the don't play or whatever? Mute tab. There we go. Now you guys can't hear it. Go. Oh, oh is it just, is it just a still? Okay, so we should follow up on. I know I I thought it would at least still play, but it doesn't appear to be playing. Not nah, playing. <laughs> I'm just dumb. Uh, I should have assumed it would be a still because it's a song. Why would you? I'm dumb. Um, are you sure the answer of this level is one of the list tube sites? Is on the list tube site. I'm not, but <laughs> those of the not prawn community are usually really nice when it comes to like me trying to solve something and I fall down a rabbit hole that can get me copyright strikes, they're usually like, why don't you look somewhere else? And they haven't nicely given me that nudge. So I, I kind of feel like I'm on the right track. I, I, I do the not prawn weeklies with a net is the best way to describe it. 
They're not nice? They called you a name? <gasps> Who called Thick a name? Uh, what, was I, what was I doing? Bullshit. Well, Weaver says you're a liar. <laughs> so clearly you're a liar. Uh, let me open up my new things here. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Uh, Sunday. There we go. Well, well, well. What do we have here? Yo, Kermit, I think you nailed it in trying to think what these things had in common. Uh... Hulk trivia! Liz, Liz Loeb is a friend of his. I did not know that. <laughs> Thank you for Hawk trivia. <laughs> you have subscribed to Hawk trivia. Uh, is... This is claiming to be 14 songs, right? You're still muted, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, plus the other two. Interesting. Uh. So just claps in the chat for uh, JP and uh, uh, Kermit, because I think you're on to something. Uh, so now we have to figure out what the other two things are. Uh, yeah, yes. <laughs> this is, suddenly we're getting very serious. Uh, you can tell me, but I'm going to philosophize here. Uh, while you're talking, just so I can get my ideas out there. Because I've done a lot of, like, chatting, but not a lot of solving. You guys have been doing a lot of solving. So we believe that this is a playlist of the soundtrack to Reality Bites, plus two extra songs that have weird names. One is called Split'em, and the other is called Visioneer. Right? I, again, I'm not... These, oh, these won't play. I haven't muted. All right, so this is called split them. So I don't know what we're splitting. So, but it, that seems like it's maybe like direction. Uh, unless I should be looking up Quan the ruler, uh, or maybe ruler something with measurement or something like that. Uh, those two extra could be garbage and not ma <laughs> not matter. That's true. I, I doubt it. <laughs> I feel like they're there for a reason. Unless the answer is just reality bites and everybody should throw confetti. Confetti? Uh, well, th thank you, Brazilian watcher. <laughs> um... I feel like the clue is either something in, like, ruler and measurement or possibly telling me to split something up. Uh, I'm trying to remember the plot of Reality Bites because, like, she's torn between Ethan Hawke and Ben Stiller, right? Uh, Winona Ryder. So maybe there's something about splitting up the relationship. I don't know. Throwing stuff out here. Uh, this visioneer is is that the name of the song visioneer uh do you think the titles are a visioneer cipher how do i do a visioneer cipher again it's not it's like a it's like a complex caesar cipher i think I know it said Visioneer a moment ago, but I don't remember how to spell it. <laughs> B I G E N. Visioneer cipher. 
the code on time. Split reality in bytes. The little bite-sized realities. You know, just... That, that's how you should kind of live life. Just accept reality in, like, little bite-sized pellets. Don't try to take in all of reality. Just, like, little, just like, mmm. We should, we should really do something about the environment. Well, that's enough for today. Uh, so we know... Uh, Fox. That actually could just also be a band. That sounds like a death metal band. Vox. And the other one is more X. Jeez. That's not a word. X C Y U. X C Y U. Haas. Haas. B J G B J G L E L E Brute Force No Um And Okay, yeah, this is the one that needs like a keyword. So basically it's um like if if the keyword was key, like it's suggesting here. The first letter would be encoded that A was K. Yeah, and then and then so on. And then the second letter is encoded that A is E. And then the third letter is A is Y. And then continues. And then it just repeats that cipher. Uh, so we would need the key which I assume is Reality Bytes, right? It did not get me anything. I'm typing in the wrong field? Oh, yes, I am. Thank you. I want to replace key. Reality bytes. Decrypt. Error, sorry. <laughs> Alphabet empty. God damn it. Hold on. <laughs> Control C. Let me just refresh this page so I can bring back the alphabet. No, bring, bring back the alphabet. Do I have to? Uh, A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z. Now I decrypt. Chomp! <laughs> Chomp in the nonsense. <laughs> I need to sing it because I'm doing a show. <laughs> uh, uh, Chomp? <laughs> Uh, maybe, could you believe it? Maybe Chomp is right. <laughs> I like Chomp as being an answer. Uh, I already copied this, right? Let me copy this just to be safe. Maybe we should do them separately. Oops. Oh, of course. Chomp? 
was chop a coincidence? Because that's awesome. Uh, fun fact, ampersand was a letter from the alphabet. Ampersand? I know I, I, I had to do a thing on, like, old letters, and there was, like, ash. And, oh, where were the other ones? I only remember ash. But, like, I remember, like, looking up old-timey letters. And I think it was upside down uh, exclamation point was originally punctuation that was supposed to denote sarcasm. I think. <laughs> Questionable interesting fact. Uh, all right, so we got chomp, which is weird. See, Chomp wouldn't have used all of reality bites. It wouldn't even have used all of reality. It would only use some of reality. <laughs> only some of reality was used to create Chomp. No Hulahan, 2021. Uh, maybe split them like this. Chomp and bite are synonyms. Fact. <laughs> uh, what else could we do? Because um, that wasn't right. So I did, yeah, hold on. Oh, here's an idea, ready? No, it might have screwed it up is the space. Reality. Reality bites. Maybe it's that, aha, uh -huh. oh. Decrypt. Chomp. Chompy. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. What am I doing? I just want to become famous, you know? I need more follows. Hey! I could buy followers and primes and viewers and big follows. How oh, cool. No, no. I, I thought I had ban power by clicking stuff. Can I ban you? I wish to ban him. I do not wish to add him as friend. I want to ban him. No. I thought I was a... I thought I had ban powers. I thought I'd learned that I had ban powers with this. I will ban you. No. No. <laughs> no to all of this. All right, he's gone. All right. There are no coincidences in Visioneer? True, I guess, yeah. I mean, Chomp is a, a big deal. Let me just, out of curiosity, let me add the space and just see if it does anything to this. Chomp. No, so I got the same thing. So the space didn't matter. Uh. Oh, chomp and biter. Oh, okay. I just realized why you said that. <laughs> I was like, chomp and bite. Yeah, they are. Hmm. Uh, 
So maybe the second word is uh, a synonym for reality. Like maybe it's the answer is like chump existence or chump nonfiction. And then the, ne- the end of the puzzle is just me eating a biography. So do I have to eat a biography? That's what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for the puzzle where it's like, the next part is cut your finger off and mail it to a dress. Well, I want to win. Uh, I'm playing Taboo. <laughs> No, I'm just drinking a smoothie. I used to drink Soylent. I actually used to really like Soylent. Uh, There was a Soylent-like fruit that tasted like Fruit Loops that was delicious. And I was one of those guys that, like, I did Soylent for two meals uh, a day. And I grew breasts. And then I stopped. (laughs) But Soylent's delicious. Like, it, it really is. It's cause, well. It's soy based. It's just you're just drinking soy. So uh, show boob. Well, I don't. Ha- well, first off, I will get banned. <laughs> and secondly, this was like, I don't know. Four years ago now that I did that. I had to. I had to. Uh, I was commuting to work because I usually work from home. Uh, but in the summer, I had to. Uh, work in the office and I was spending way too much money at this place across the street to eat so I was like I'm just gonna buy a case of Soylent and that's gonna be uh, my 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 food while I'm there and then I was the weird Soylent guy at the office for a while and uh, then I had to stop I feel like such a scrub I didn't do my hair all nice for this and now I'm a weird Soylent guy I told you I had boobs (laughs) What is this stream? Man, reality bites. Uh, split them. Split them. Like, that's the only piece of information we haven't used is split them. Boink. The guy split them. No. See, wouldn't it make sense that the code for this was reality and the code for this was bytes if you split them up? I, I know I already did it, but I'm just going to do it again. Freaking, I'll freaking do it again. What? Why did that happen? What the fuck? <laughs> Um, out of curiosity, hold on. One, two, three, four, five. So this is five. So it's in using reality bytes as the key. One, two, three, four, five. I'm only getting to the I. Real I is what I'm using to get chomp. It's a hell of a coincidence, if it's a coincidence. Uh, Bites is only five words, though. Like, how long is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's twelve... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Maybe I do it separately, like this, and then decrypt. No. Chomp. No. I 
Oh, it's showing up over here in, under results. Right above this lovely ad. Am I... Is it... Wait. Do you think maybe it's... Reality Bites... Soundtrack? But spelled correctly? No, see, I'm still getting that double E. Here's a question. This is just to double check. I did write it correctly, right? T L O X X. T L O X X. All right. X C Y U. X C Y U. H O S. H O S. V J G L E. V J G L E. Okay. Try Ethan Hawk. <laughs> Or just try soundtrack. I'll try that too. Ah, uh, to grip correctly. That didn't do anything. No. No. Ethan Hulk. I don't have a good reason to do that, but but I'm doing it for you. Chomp is so weird. It's such a weird thing. What could... All right, hive mind. Because I got JP and I got Kermit here, who I know are on my team and don't know the answers. Uh, split them. Split them. What could that mean? Because that's literally the only clue that we have that we haven't used, is that... This song here is called Split 'em by Quan the Ruler. What should I be splitting, or is there something with measurement that we could be doing? Is there any I'm like looking for like words with it like foot, meter, meter, music. I'm really stretching here. Yeah, I mean I think reality bites is I think key information because this is the soundtrack and it got us the word chomp which is so weird but I think where we're at right now is I kind of feel like chomp is correct just because the way visioneer works it's so easy to get gibberish the fact that we got a word at all is mind bottling for more Ben Stiller for you I think the issue is we are missing the split them instruction or the ruler instruction. And I think once we have that information, we can kind of like unlock everything. What do we do with the solution? Uh, well, with these not prawn things, uh, you just kind of get the answer. When the puzzle is active, the weekly puzzles are active, there's a place to enter what you think the answer is, and then it's like, you win! Uh, since this is no longer active, we don't have that luxury, so probably someone like Weaver or Kellis will be like, you win! And then I'll edit in, like, confetti. <laughs> uh, is it just a word? It could be a word, it could be a phrase. Um, 
Actually, you know what? Hold on. I'm incorrect. Uh, I'm supposed to enter it, which I have not tried just entering Reality Bites or Chomp. Let's give it a try. Reality. Let's not do it in all caps. Reality Bites dot html. I forgot that like Kellis is, or not Kellis, uh, Ender is real good at making these things. I forgot about Giggle Bunnies. Chomp. I forgot to put the HTML. Hold on. sound haunts me i hate i know i usually mute it <laughs> i usually get upset at some point now i will mute that tab i haven't gotten there yet but i'm close uh split them split them by quan is quan something that i don't is like quan a group of six letters because <laughs> that would be ideal quan Does the word Quan mean anything? What does Quan mean? It means coin. Twisa Quan to your witcher. Oh, marry you. That's not the entire soundtrack? Is there a song missing? Because this is what popped up for me. Though I will say that the Violent Femme cover is not on here. Maybe this is just what's on the CD. Yeah, this is just what's on the album. Interesting. I need to make one of these not prawn weeklies. It's what I got to do. Make y'all suffer. Got some evil ideas. I got some evil ideas I could do. This weekly is broken. Uh, it. This is the only one that's on SoundCloud, which I find to be suspicious. That every single one of these is on YouTube except for this. So. Cloud? Um, maybe, do I get rid of bytes and just do reality? Maybe it's just reality? Decrypt. I gotta make it first. I don't know how, how late are we, are you guys doing the weekly thing? Cause like, I would say maybe I could get one done by mid November. Cause I got a bunch of other night mom thing. Oh, did you, oh, I didn't even think of just Googling this. Flocks the boy. <laughs> he 
You got time until like next May. All right. Uh, and then is the other person a person? <laughs> That's a great sentence, Noah. You're doing great, Noah. No, that's nothing. All right, I, I'm gonna chalk that up to coincidence. I still feel like this Visioneer cipher is. Do we got anything acrostic going on here? Come here, chat, let me borrow you. There's a U. Or, no. Song titles, M S B W G S A L S no. No, none of that is words. There's not enough vowels. Um, also, that would just be a coincidence because this is the soundtrack to Reality Bites. Ah. Uh. What comes up when you move the choice onto the bottom one? Beg pardon? <laughs> what do, what's the what's the question here? Like, like it's not letting me shuffle stuff, if that's what you mean. No, I can shuffle stuff. What do you know? Should I switch them? We can try switching them. I like that's not really splitting them, but whatever. Let's see. Let's see. Reality bites. Now I can't get anything out of this. What about it being a scramble? I don't think so. I don't think there's enough vowels for it to be a scramble. Like, this is just a one O, and this is just, eh, it's got a couple, but I don't know how many, like X is a, is a tough letter to show up, and it's joined by a J and a Y. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Like, the fact that Visioneer is the name of this thing really makes me think I'm on the right track. I know! Oh, thank you for again for saying it, but I don't know what split means. Like, an even split between the two, like... Here's an idea, right? This is a dumb idea, but this is what we're going to do. Uh... Let me just control Z this so I get back to this. All right. So this is one, two, three, four, five. And then this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. So together that's 17, which I was hoping for an even number, but no. Uh, So I was thinking about maybe splitting them up, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What was the n it, it, it eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Was I an idiot? Was there eighteen? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Now there's seventeen. Uh, so. Eight and nine, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
I split it that by eight. So now they're split semi-evenly. And then we'll do reality for the first part and get chomp something still. Chompeth. And then we'll do bites for the second part. <laughs> So I, I like the idea that maybe there's a different Visioneer code for each of them. Like a different keyword for each one of these words. Like that makes sense to me. Uh, Take out the repeating letters? Take out the repeating letters in reality bytes. That would just be T, right? An E? I don't know why we would do that. <laughs> I will do it <laughs> because you told me to. Oh, an I. I don't think that's anything. Um, <laughs> so, because, like, maybe it's just reality. Because let, let me explain what's happening with Chomp, right? The T is becoming a C because A is R, which would make... Or R is A, S is B, T is C, right? So that's how you get the C. And then the next w w letter, the L, is, a co is encoded with E. So E is A. So Chomp is correct, so forget about it for now. Right, okay, good. The, the issue I'm having is it's only... Like, I can get chomp with just this. That gets me chomp. So, the, the keyword is not really reality. It's real eye. Uh, does, th does that mean the <laughs> it's T-bytes is what I need? Like that is that the splitting we're doing? T bytes. It's just I've tried just bytes and it doesn't get me anything. Unless I'm supposed to look at wolf of flux and, and be like, answer. Is that not something? I don't think it's something. Uh, what is chomp used for? Eating.
Do I then decode this with chomp? Is them like... If I took this, did this... Nope, screwed it up, hit the wrong button. All right, copy this, paste this. Chomp. Decrypt. Unreal.zip! This is stupid! <laughs> no, 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 no. No! Why? I don't know what it was supposed to tell me to do that. Like, that's that seems like a big jump in logic for me. In my opinion, I think that's a big jump in logic. Because you have to accept gibberish as a correct answer. And I guess you might be able to make that conclusion. Was like, and Because I was at that point where I was like, this made chomp. This should make answer. Reality made chomp. Bite should make answer. And instead it made gibberish. But no, it's just double vision. All right. I have no idea what you're talking about, JP. <laughs> unreal. Unreal. It's almost unreal. It's almost unreal. You can name the movie that that's from. I will give you a nickel. <laughs> I, I will PayPal you if you know anything about that song. It's almost unreal. No. No, I'm not going to do that, Winroy. <laughs> Stop telling me to do that. This came up. Password protected. I was going to lose my mind. Just just open this, please. Now I'm grumps. I'm grumps, guys. I'm grumps. Can we please... I, oh my god, how many... Stop! How many things are there? Pow upside down, which is, of course, mod. And an upside down exclamation point used to be uh, a signification of sarcasm. Or I mod, I mod. Pow upside down is I mod. Okay. Cool. I'm odd. <laughs> the oh, I'm odd, yeah. <laughs> Someone's got to be observant. <laughs> sure isn't me. Oh my god. Oh, wait, we've gone. Hold on. Okay. Two. I'm not, I'm not buying it. <laughs> Must be Braille. No! No! How long is this puzzle? All right. So, before we could do that, no, stop going into my temporary instructions. Find the solution equals one plus two plus three, lowercase, no spaces, solve an order. Okay. No. I will do no such thing. 
I will just mess my hair up more. <laughs> So this is where we're at. Oh my god. I think about the Dexcon puzzle constantly. The the $5,000 Dexcon escape room. I think about that all the time. And how, like, I feel like I could do it now. Like, the first year I did it, I was just, like, so new to puzzles. I think I could do it now. And I think Vinny knew that. And that's why he stopped offering that challenge. But that's a story for another time. Here we are, once again. I'm blown into pieces. Uh, this is what we'll be tackling next week. We've made it to the iMod stage. Which is POW upside down. So we will... Uh, uh, tackle this i'm so sorry <laughs> like I, i'm so tired and drained by what we just did and i was like i really felt like i was gonna get confetti and <laughs> and streamers i was like we did it this is that's totally finished line but it's not we're gonna do this again tomorrow not tomorrow next week on tuesday wednesday is for the witness and thursday is for baba is you uh thank you so much for watching uh, new stream schedule will finally be coming in September. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to Plus Two, Two Comedy Gaming to catch up on all my past live streams. And you know what, guys? I will see you all next time. Oh, and also check out uh, the Push Nevada episode of uh, Stay Doom that's dropping later today. It's a good one. Mm, boop!